Hi, my name is Amina Vance. I'm Dr. Lamb's hair transplant coordinator, um, and I'm going to be demonstrating how to use the hair building fibers. Dr. Lamb uh, worked with a company to design non-toxic hair fibers, and the this um, SL Max is um, contain only plant-based fiber, gosepium fibers, um, so no toxic um, and chemicals in it. So the hair, uh, hair fibers are used daily, usually are used to uh, camouflage thinning area. And so for example, I'm going to demonstrate here. So um, I'm going to uh, either uh, apply on a corner here so you can see the idea behind this application is that the fibers are deposited onto the hair just above the scalp. You don't want to clump them and you want to move hairs around so that the hairs, that the uh, fibers are linking to the hair and then they create a webbing that creates a volume and hides the thinning scalp. scalp. Um, hair building fibers are polarized so they attach better to dry and clean hair and no hair products such as pomade or wax because that depolarizes the fiber. So um, I'm going to use my left hand. So I shake the bottle and as I'm shaking the bottle, I'm moving hairs around. Uh, my um, uh, model today does not need hair fibers, but it's a great, um, she is um, a great example of how we can move hairs and apply the fibers and then continue. You continue moving hairs as you're applying the fibers and you go through the entire area. The same thing with apply for the, um, crown keep in mind that you don't want to put too many fibers on the scalp and if you're using the pump so i'm going to show you how to use the pump you're going to unscrew the top remove you can screw the applicator keep in mind that the applicator will push the fibers other uh, under the pressure so you don't want to point the applicator toward the scalp you want a more put it like a parallel to the scalp so that fibers are deposited just above the scalp and create that webbing that you want to create with these hair building fibers. If you're building the hairline, then um, you're going to use this little applicator and then you're going to apply just above. So what it does, it, it creates um, irregular hairline that looks more natural. Don't ever come with the fibers too close to the hairline because that doesn't look natural. Once you're finished applying the fibers, you're going to use the sealer and keep in mind that the sealer, if applied too close, it, it leaves hair wet and it comes out as a, a too much a product. So you want to make it from a distance, just gentle application so the uh, sealer is spread all over the entire top. You can touch here, and the thing that I like about these fibers is you can adjust the hair and then they don't come, they don't clump and then don't come on your um, hands or on your clothes. However, be careful not to touch your hair too much because eventually you are going to depolarize the fibers and they're going to come off um, hair. If you're using fibers, um, it's recommended that you wash your hair, um, especially if you're using any topical treatment. So you have to wash your fibers off before you would do any laser treatment or any topical compounded medication such as formula 82M, 82F. Um, um, make sure that the fibers are not building on top of each other, especially if you put the sealer and day after day, um, at least every two days, wash your hair. If you're not using the formula, but if you're using the formula, you have to wash your hair daily in order to apply the um, medication. Thank you.